reading like a native speaker. The two donkeys. They too were carrying loads. They were two donkeys. One was carrying a load of gold coins, and another one was carrying a sack of rice grains. The donkey who was carrying the load of gold coins felt very happy and proud, being in good mood. He started waving his neck. At that, the bell of his neck created an attractive rhythmic music. On the other hand, the donkey who was carrying the sack of rice grains was following the other donkey dejectedly and almost without sound. In the meantime, some decoits saw the two donkeys. Observing closely, they found out which one of the two donkeys was carrying gold coins. They killed the proud donkey and walked away with the sack of gold coins, leaving the second donkey behind. The donkey thought that he did not die because he wasn't carrying valuable load. As you sow, so you reap. Reading like a native speaker, the two donkeys. They too were carrying loads. There were two donkeys. One was carrying a load of gold coins, and another one was carrying a sack of rice grains. The donkey who was carrying the load of gold coins felt very happy and proud, being in good mood. He started waving his neck. At that, the bell of his neck created an attractive rhythmic music. On the other hand, the donkey. Who was carrying the sack of rice grains was following the other donkey dejectedly and almost without sound. In the meantime, some decoits saw the two donkeys. Observing closely, they found out which one of the two donkeys was carrying gold coins. They killed the proud donkey and walked away with the sack of gold coins, leaving the second donkey behind. The donkey thought that. He did not die because he wasn't carrying valuable load. As you sow, so you reap.